In this video, we'll look at how to make a linear regression, also known as a line of best fit, using OpenOffice. I've created some data here. The x values are 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. And here are the y values, 15, 17, 21, 26, and 33. In order to make my line of best fit, I first need a scatter plot. So I'll highlight all my data and go up to Insert. And near the bottom of the insert menu is chart. I'll click on chart, automatically a bar graph comes up, but also the option to change it. So I'll change it to an XY scatter, which is a scatter plot. You can go through some of the options here, though none of them are really important to us. You could just click finish right away, but if you want to look at these options, you could play with name the data labels, for example, or give the graph a title, label the X and Y axis, those are important. But right now we're just looking at how to make the line of best fit. So once we've created that scatter plot, I just click finish. I click on my points and then right click and it says insert trend line. I'll click on insert trend line. It gives me a few choices, but this is a video about making a line of best fit. So we'll leave our regression type, our line of best fit linear. And we'll ask it to show equation and show the correlation coefficient squared. We check those and click OK. And there you have it. Here's our equation. We can move this over by clicking on this box and dragging and dropping it. And now we've got our equation for our line of best fit on the graph. The equation is f at x equals 4.5x plus 8.9. And the correlation coefficient squared is 0.96. We could square root that to get the correlation coefficient. And that's it. That's how you add a line of best fit in an open document, in open office. You first create your graph, change it to a scatter, add your trend line, and then make sure when you're doing that to show the equation and show the correlation coefficient. And you've done it.